I don't believe there was a single event that we can call the Exodus. This person can't have seen all this. He imagined it. So far, there is no documented evidence about the Exodus. Exodus did not happen in the way that it is described in the text. How can we prove that? You look for a collapse in Egyptian civilization, and that's where you'll find Moses and the Exodus. If we can prove there even was an Exodus, telling us that there was no Jericho at the time that Joshua conquered the Promised Land, and therefore Joshua is a piece of fiction, and therefore the conquest is a piece of fiction, why don't we ask the simple question, when was Jericho destroyed? Do you think this is Joseph? Either it is Joseph, or it's somebody remarkably the same. We have tombs that are clearly those of foreigners, Semites, we can tell this by the pottery, by the kind of weapons. These are not Egyptian type daggers. They have donkeys in some cases buried with them. This was not an Egyptian practice. This is real evidence for the time when the Israelites were in Egypt as slaves. We were slaves? Uh, why? I mean, if you're gonna dream up a story, surely you'd come up with a better one than that. Look at your evidence and come to a conclusion based on the evidence. Why is it that we've never heard of these finds? because in the scheme that's used by scholars to date all these events, they're way too early. We may be wrong 10 years here and 10 years there, but there's no way, you know, to, to shift centuries. Yes, it would undo a lot of their books, wouldn't it? It certainly would, yes. Patterns of Evidence, The Exodus.